Listen, man, we know that when you get to the gates of heaven eventually, God is going to <laughs> God is going we will to pull see. up your timeline. I'm almost sure at the at the golden gates, he's gonna pull up your timeline. So what we want to do is we want to get you ready for that. And we're gonna pull up okay. your timeline right now. We pulled up five random tweets, and I want to oh, get boy. kind of your backstory on where we are, what are we doing, <laughs> what's going on. <laughs> in this thing yeah. right here i remember that day actually uh we were doing a a tour of the performance center and i don't know why i had that shirt on but it was <laughs> i think i i don't know what joke i told him but he just started laughing afterwards it was yeah it was just like a random tour at the performance center but That's crazy. Uh, it's it's funny to me just just because of like the size difference you know like <laughs> Omos makes me look like a toddler. And so, right. you know, it's it's just, it's such a funny photo. But uh, Listen, yeah. If they ever want to reboot Twins, I mean, it's right. I don't know if you've well, seen this. Well, I thought you were going to say different strokes, but yes, Twins is. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. All right. So we got the next tweet up right here. Edge, Kevin Owens, Bivin Enterprises shirt. What's going through your mind during this kind of? phase kevin owens wearing your stuff on television on national television you know what's crazy so i had smackdown on and i went to walk my dog real quick during a commercial break mm -hmm. and i just got lost in time or whatever so when i came back and looked at my phone it, it had just blown up and so you know is, is a really good friend of mine and i appreciate it because you know any any opportunity that he gets to you know help me out or or someone else out you know he does and that's an incredibly rare thing and one thing that i forgot to mention earlier new day big e kofi xavier they've done the exact same thing and i probably would not be in this position without mm -hmm. all of them you know mm -hmm. and that's the honest to god truth so when a kevin owens you know when he does something like that you know i I genuinely appreciate it because it's getting my name out there. And I also right. think it's funny that Edge is looking at that shirt like, what is it? <laughs> I have no idea what this is. And, I think, <laughs> and to me, you know, that makes the photo. So uh, I was very happy when I saw that. You know, I thought it was pretty funny. Oh, my God. We have the next one up. Listen, this is a video. But you, is there a running gag on how you're going to break Ivy <laughs> There actually is. So so I noticed that she would break every every promo segment. And I told her and I said, Hey, if you keep breaking, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna start to make you break. And she was like, No, don't do that. Yeah, yeah. So it happens every time. And she's trying to get better at it, but but it's a struggle. She is holding on for dear life every every segment. And it's just it's the funniest thing because everyone has noticed and everyone has told her. Hey, I think she did the last. Don't break. Don't crack. <laughs> I think, I think she did the last night as well too. When you guys were doing your little pep speech right before the match started. <laughs> really? She, I think she was trying to hold it back even then. <laughs> That's great. That's great. Bless it doesn't help uh, yeah. so close to the camera, so she can't like. <laughs> she, she can't turn away. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But but in that clip, she was, she was shaking. She was shaking because because after we did it. I went back and watched it. And then like when I looked over at her while I was watching it on the monitor, like I could just see it in her face. But you know, but again, that's just a testament to her because you know, she is able to to be in the moment and and enjoy it. And even though, you know, we're laughing at it, you know, I think there's something um I don't know, I think there's something nice about that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like like she like she is present and she is just enjoying everything that's going on on around her. So, you know, I think that's pretty cool. And you know what else? It, it, it doesn't make her look look any like less intimidating. She's still terrifying. It, it, you know what I mean? It, oh, she's terrifying. Was, it, it, <laughs> yeah, she is terrifying. I so like legitimately, I was at uh, at the gym this morning, and so it, you know we were doing um, uh, squats, and I looked over at what she was squatting, and I felt embarrassed. Like I honestly <laughs> just wanted to like pack my stuff and go yeah. home. Like what it am I was doing here? it was insane. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she wasn't even sweating. Like I was looking like Luca Vandross at the Soul Train Awards. Like I was just drenched, and she didn't break a sweat at all. So again, she's a powerhouse. Oh my God, we got the next one up. Listen, when Luda joins Diamond Mine and I get three cameos in the Fast and Furious Ten, 
How? What's the yeah. update on that? What's the? <laughs> I'm still working on it. You know, um, uh, Dwayne has not returned my phone calls. So I have no idea why. Wow. Um, I think he may have me blocked at this point, but I'm working on it. So you know, okay. hopefully soon. Luda. Hopefully soon. Oh, Luda, we need one. Um, next one up. I will tell the story behind this one day. Today oh. is the day. <laughs> because I realized at some point you weren't yeah. Rick James and you were Bret Hart. <laughs> yes, I don't. I don't think. I don't think I can tell that story. I, so here's the thing. I don't think what we shot will ever see the light of day. But I don't think that I could tell um, of the story yet because, knowing my luck, I would tell it and then it would be released tomorrow. But um, we shot. <laughs> this thing years ago and so yeah the idea is is i am i am related to to bret hart and i'll just leave it at that so hopefully one day <laughs> i'll be able to share it with the world but um we actually used shana's car for the video and so that's mm. why i am hugging her because as soon as i got in the car she looked at me and she said hey if you mess anything up they will find you in a body bag and so i got out of the car <laughs> And I said, hey, give me a hug. So that's an impromptu <laughs> photo that the cameraman took. So, yeah. Oh, my God. And, of course, we have the last photo, I guess, very apropos, considering everything that we've learned during uh -oh. this interview. Sometimes I want to delete this app, but then I see something <laughs> wrong, like Cesaro wearing a do-rag, and I immediately change my mind. Yeah. Yeah. I'm in mine certified. That. Yeah. Yeah. The do-rag king. Yes. Yes. I <laughs> forgot that I even tweeted that. But it's true. It's true. Um, that's a great photo. And, and when I saw it, I just laughed. I think I just laughed for, for like legit 20 minutes. Cause it's just, it's so absurd. Just look at his fit though. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. The fit, and when you look at him now, it just, it does not compute. Like it's just, if you think about it hard enough, your brain just may short circuit. 